kite day. Fly a kite. Kites are many colors and shapes. Some kites are made of paper. Some kites are made of cloth. Some kites are made of plastic. Some kites are huge. Some kites are tiny. The first kites were made of silk or paper. A flying start. There was once a farmer. He lived in China. One day, he was working outside. The wind blew his hat away. The hat had strings to tie it on. The farmer caught hold of one of the strings. The hat flew above him. The first kite was made. Parts of a kite. Many people fly kites today. Kites have frames. Frames are made of sticks or poles. Kites have a sail to catch the wind. Kites have strings too. Some kite flying tips: one, choose a windy day. Two, you will need lots of space. Keep away from trees and power cables. Three, ask a friend to help push your kite into the air. Kites take off. Long ago. There was an explorer. His name was Marco Polo. He was born in Italy. There are stories about his adventures. Marco Polo went to China. He saw people flying kites. He had never seen a kite before. Marco Polo went home to Italy. He showed people how to fly a kite. That is how kite flying spread around the world. Kites around the world. People all around the world fly kites. There are kite shows. There are prizes for the best kites. In Japan. There are kite shows on special days. Kite shows in Japan began a long time ago. A kite day. There was once a king. He lived in Japan. The king had a baby boy. He was very proud. He flew a kite over his city. The kite had the name of his baby boy on it. All the people who lived nearby could see it. Today, Japanese people fly kites to mark the same baby's birthday. Kites for racing. People also use kites in sports. Kites are fixed to skis. They can be fixed to surfboards and kayaks too. A beach where people race with kites. Kites have a long history. They have been used for many things. What do you think kite flying will be used for in the future?